That breaking news comes to us from Dayton in Liberty County. A constable severely injured after being hit by a truck. It happened as Constable Justin Johnson was helping his deputies direct traffic. A truck drove around some orange cones that they had set up as a warning to drivers and then slammed into another truck before spinning into that deputy. Now, two other people also hurt in that crash, including a child. Channel 2's Jennifer Bauer has been on the scene off Highway 146 and FM 1413 all evening. She's joining us live now with the very latest. Jennifer? Well, Justin Johnson has lived in Liberty County his entire life. He is a father and a well-respected elected official. Tonight, a cousin of his tells us he remains in critical condition and is in surgery right now. Liberty County Precinct 1 Constable Justin Johnston was just doing his job, helping deputies direct traffic on Highway 146. When investigators say the driver of this red pickup truck passed a line of stopped cars using the shoulder, he blew through a barricade and slammed head on into this black SUV, which is a county police vehicle, but no one was inside. The red pickup truck hit the county unit head on at a high rate of speed. The truck spun around sideways, and the rear end of the truck is what hit the constable from Precinct 1, knocked into the pavement. His injuries so severe, Johnston was flown to Memorial Hermann Hospital. There, deputies are gathering in support. At the scene, the investigation is ongoing. DPS deputies tell Channel 2 the driver of the pickup truck was Samuel Leva. Leva's eight-year-old daughter was also in the vehicle. She was. She was talking. She was complaining of injuries. The driver and his daughter were flown to the hospital. Investigators say both of them were alert and talking when they left. Now, as you can see behind me, the scene out here remains quite large as DPS continues to investigate. We are told portions of Highway 146 will remain closed for the next several hours. We are also told that Samuel Leva, again, he is the driver of the red pickup truck. We are told his blood will be drawn at the hospital for toxicology tests. We are live in Liberty County tonight. I'm Jennifer Bauer, KPRC Channel 2 News.